Good morning. It is December 23rd and I am here at Wally State Park. Today I am going to be going on the Palooza Cascades Trail and climbing up to Wally Knob. There is fresh snow on all of the mountains and we have clear skies. So this is going to be a beautiful winter hike and yeah it is a couple of days before Christmas so I didn't have time for a full day hike but I am going to be doing this and getting in some beautiful holiday winter views. It is just below freezing so I'm going to get moving to warm up. made it up onto the train trestle and this is one of the reasons I love Palouse the Cascades because it uh, follows an old railroad so you get to be on all these cool old structures um, and also like that view is insane with the clouds and everything see all the fresh snow we just got so pretty always nice to have beautiful December days like this and I can see where I'm going and it's in the sun so that is encouraging because it is pretty chilly in the shade but um, from Palouse Cascades then I go up a boot path that will take me to the uh, the knob summit I am over halfway up this thing and the view has been awesome and uh, I've just been going through uh, off and on slushy snow which is melting very quickly but uh, you might have noticed him in the sun which is so nice it's not freezing anymore so that is so refreshing and I mean the view has been gorgeous on these mountains so <sighs> it's gonna be an even better view up top I give you a lolly knob. Ah, I came here about two years ago and it was completely socked in with clouds. So I have always wanted to come back and get this view and I really don't think I could have asked for a better one. Look at how pretty these clouds are like just dotting the mountains with the fresh snow and everything. Oh wow, but yeah, this is such a cool little spot and 
I always wanted to see what it looks like on a clear day. I am definitely the only one here because I made all the footprints up this thing. So I am going to enjoy this winter wonderland because I am not in a rush and boy do I need it. So I will give the tour. That there, that is Mailbox Peak. And then behind the cloud here is gonna be Dirty Box Peak, Dirty Harry's Peak. And then over here, the one with the snow on it, that is Web Mountain Putrid Pete's Peak. And then behind it will be Mount Defiance. And then this is up the corridor to Snoqualmie Pass. And then we have Songbird Peak here, I believe Change Peak, and then is that McClellan Butte? I'll have to double check what that point is. And then one of my favorite parts of this view, it's really hard to see with the lighting, but right down there is Hall Creek Falls, which is a really cool looking waterfall. You can only see if you go up this little trail. And here is the main viewpoint area. It's kind of this flat spot to hang out. Normally this is like this rocky ridge type thing. So it continues through the trees up there. And then all down this ah, is the mountain. Oh, wow. Love, love seeing snow top trees with a blue sky behind them. But um, yeah, I had a pretty rough week, so I really needed to get out and see the mountains, get some wilderness therapy, and yeah, this was the perfect place to come right before the holiday. Really see everything getting covered in snow on this beautiful, beautiful day. <sighs> With this view, yeah, definitely, definitely what I needed. <laughs> I just enjoyed a beautiful solitary time up on this ridge, but now I've basically gotten cold enough that I need to start moving again. So I am going to head back and I wanted to mention that uh, this does involve a little bit of a scramble to get on here and I'll show. This is a bit of the ridge line. Now the bits that I need to scramble are dry or not exposed or anything, but like if this is icy and uh, there is some exposure, so just be aware of that, that to get up on this thing, there is a little bit of that involved. If that's something that freaks you out, if you don't like heights, this is not a good one, but ah, I like being on top of the tree. Look at that. <laughs> that's pretty fun. Ah, definitely not a bad view, but saying goodbye to this view and heading out. better look at Hall Creek Falls. I don't think the sun is going to hit it anymore because it's so late in the year, but this is a really good viewpoint for that waterfall. It's pretty cool. It's a decent sized waterfall for being so tucked away.
Wow, so I made it back and that was just perfect. Um, it's so close to the holiday, so I didn't have time for a full day hike, but this was perfect half day climb to get some elevation gain in and to see some views, which I really needed. Ever since I went to Alali Knob a couple of years ago, I've been wanting to come back and get the view, and I am so glad I did. It was absolutely stunning seeing the fresh snow on all the mountains, especially right before the holiday, because that really, that really gets you in the mood. And yeah, the mountains and the clouds were showing off today, that's for sure, but it was just so much fun. Um, this is definitely one of those ones that is short but steep, because it is oh, 1,200 feet of climbing in about a mile and has that little uh, scrambly bit near the top that you definitely don't want to do if there's ice on the rock or if it's wet or anything um, and there's a little bit of exposure but it's really fun and I can definitely see myself coming back here but yeah perfect day to come out and do some exploring right before the holidays and this is probably my last climb in 2023 for real this time so ah what a fun way to close out the year seeing the mountains covered in snow i'll probably be starting 2024 seeing the mountains covered in snow again so <laughs> anyway thank you so much for watching and here are my favorite pictures from the trail today enjoy